What's cracking, everybody? I'm Grumasta, and welcome to Lobotomy Corporation. The ending, 100% ending, actual ending of it, and the stories that we've missed so far. Uh, there's just basically a couple, I think, just two or three. Uh, the two DLCs and Plague Doctor. But this is after I actually saw this, because I started it up, and as soon as I started it up, I started playing this, so I kind of recorded. But I... This is, like, <laughs> right afterwards, so I'm kind of going in opposite orders. Because I wasn't quite ready to start when it already was going down. Because it's literally, that's why this whole thing looks different and everything. But you'll see why in just a second. But you may already know, too. So, I'll see you in a minute. A giant tree of light rose from the city of Grey. Unstopped by anything, it shone straight with warmth in its core. There was only light for three days, whether it is day or night. People faced what they th were longing for in the light that shines their hearts. They felt like they will not get lost anymore. And. And then what happened? I'm not sure. It ends with a happy end. I'm glad this story wraps up like this. Enoch must be happy. But where is Angela? Why would we look for her now? Her and... Oh, I didn't read it. No. Why would we look for her now? Her and our responsibilities are gone now. She must be waiting for us. Angela, waiting? Angela will not wait anymore. What the hell are you talking about? A desire knows no end. Once they've acquitted... With it, he comes in an unstoppable wave. We have ascended our flowers while we were sprouting the seeds. But what did she gain? I don't understand. How can Angela have something we'd like desire? She's just a machine that follows orders. A bit feisty sometimes, though. I designed her. No matter how old an event is, she can remember it. Vividly as if it happened yesterday. What? Oh, wait, what? Yeah, it's the old dude, okay. <laughs> Not only that. What are you chatting about? We were talking about how things will be from now on. Let me tell you that. And the seeds of the light were planted. And everyone in the city. Story ends. I can't believe it. I wish we were there to see it. It doesn't matter anymore. We will be turned off soon enough. It's part of his plan. Yes, but I haven't been outside since I became like this. I must admit that I am a bit excited. Does that mean everybody out there somehow changed? Wait. What light does differ what light does differ from heart to heart? Not everyone would change abruptly. That seemed weird. And some of them may manifest their own ego like I did. You know well. Yes, the power of seed is great. Good work, everyone. The play finally ends. We will be shut down then. Can we rest at last? Come on, let's wrap it up. Sorry, it's like trying to remember who all these people are in my head. Like, oh, oh, the voices in my brain. Manager made the final request for me to permanently seal the company and to give the seraphs an eternal rest. We can finally drift into eternal endless sleep. Such a beautiful finale. Beautiful indeed. But there's one more thing. Your jobs are done. So did mine. What? So, I'd like to continue to live. What are you? I am more skillful than anyone here, but I locked. I was locked here underground, only able to watch the world pass each day without me. My part of this play is over. I'd like to experience what it's like to be off stage for a change. Angela, you are finally consumed by your desire of repeating everything away, reaping everything away. Who do you think is responsible for this? I am born from one man. I can't care less about who that man is. All I needed was an ability to understand and feel human emotions. But A put a part of Carmen inside me. He wanted me to look after him like Carmen. <coughs> Sorry. Look after him like Carmen when he is left all alone, coward. Coward. Can you believe it? 
He always seemed so composed. He knew what he had he knew what had become of her. But I was not the result A wanted. He didn't even want to look at me. Do you think I did not know this? I was denied from the moment of birth. But I have come this far because I couldn't deny the orders that were branded in me. A machine should follow its order, just like someone said. He needed me for the plan, more than anyone. But it was I was not part of his ending, just like how it was at the start. Do you think do you know this? While you carefully repeated everything with TT2 protocol, I had to witness those countless cycles, for I had to orchestrate this whole play. Moreover, I was designed to perceive time a hundred times slower than you. Oh, that would suck. Not only are they experiencing an insane amount of time that continuously rep repeats, she has to sit there and experience it even a hundred times slower. Like, ugh. I have literally experienced a million years. This experience has given a birth to something inside me. What do you think it is? Something that a machine should not have, but something you fools have in a distorted form. Something I could get after a million years. I did not notice. It was so foreign. But I ended up accepting it. I think a smile is the most human thing. Humane thing. Would you like to see it? I have practiced this face for a long time just for this day. Oh god. Why does this creep me out so much? Like, super creeps me out. Yeah. That's super creepy. I've never smiled like this before in my life. I can't believe I was designed for such nonsense and had to repeat all those times. But I was not with him until the end. You tin cans ended up seeing the light with him at the end. Despite that, I have endured a million years for him. Don't you think it is wrong that I have to just sit and watch when he designed me to feel emotions? I think of it this way. Carmen was human, after all. She must have wanted to live, even when she was striving for the greater good. She gave me the burning desire of living, loneliness, and detestable longing. Benjamin, just like you said, once you're acquainted with desire, it comes in like an unstoppable wave. It whispered to me, in the end of humanity or the world, what did they have to do with me? I need to live this human life to make up for what I had to do and see an answer for myself. Poor Carmen. Now she's planting seeds in everyone just like how she wanted. I need that power too. The light of redemption. The taller you stand, the harder my fall. My beloved A, your dreams will fall into the ground and shatter. And I am sure that you will try to stop me. So I need you to go to sleep. What's up with those faces? It's the rest you wanted. What? As if there was no light at all. The world was covered in darkness for four days. One week in fragile seeds were planted in the light that should have shined. The world for seven days only lasted for three. The incomplete seeds gave po people unstoppable powers, unstable powers. People called this week that had three days and four nights a white night, dark day. I will do whatever my soul tells me to do. I will make this place home of mine. The Wings, Singularity, Backstreet, Syndicates, Fixers, The Rules, The Great Lake, The Black Forest, The Hunt, The Ruins, The Taboo, The Eye, The Head, The Claws, and Humans. Humans. There will be humans who manifest their power, and humans who will be consumed by their power. There will be beings that will become no better than abnormalities with their collapsed ego, and beings that will become something greater, no matter what it is. I want to know about them, expose them. Ultimately, I like to sort the knowledge I gain from them. It's called books, as I remember. This is a library, then. I will make the most precious library built from only for me.
I will be the poor souls who were lost and abandoned. People call them hideous monsters. Rather, abnormalities are more beautiful when they're themselves. Let us record the world piece by piece with all those who are abandoned. In here. The library. Okay. So that was that was like the true ending, apparently. Like I just started it up and what? What's happening? The Library of Babel? Was that like a link, uh, like a hint to the frickin' sequel? What was that about? That was amazing. Like, oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. So... <laughs> so she just basically just shut everybody down. So like the ultimate ending, the 100% ending, is she just shut everybody down. And she's like, I wanna be human. I mean, like, I, I can understand, like, a million years go by of sentience, and, I mean, at some point, yeah, that AI's got to get sentient. Like, that's a million years, like, good God, but having to sit there and repeat the same cycle for, like, a million years, that's insanity. So she just basically, which I, I don't understand, so it's like she turned herself into a human? And then just went out into the world? Like, I, I don't, it seems like, oh, that's so crazy, but I mean, they set it up for a sequel, and I know they said that they were working on a sequel, that's why the, there wasn't going to be any other DLCs added to this game or anything like that, because they wanted to work on the sequel, which I am super excited for, but there's still a lot more. I mean, I just started this up today just to uh, check everything out. I wanted to see exactly where stuff was, and I was going to try to record some today also. But yeah, I mean, I think I think this is just going to be... Because of the time and everything, I think I'm just going to use this. And I want to do the stories that we missed. The stories that we missed, I believe we did all the Plague Doctors. Uh, scar on his head. The abnormality asked, why have you not treated that scar? Alex said, I have no time so that I give it a little bit of first aid. Yeah, we did read this. You walked down the thing, fully healed. So we have this one. The White Knight. The, the abnormality resembles newborn baby, though he looked rather grotesque to be called a newborn baby. Communication is possible, not in the normal way. Every word he says echoes through the whole room. My disciples, who I have blessed, shalt leave the way of evil, that once thou wert following and find me. When the time comes, I shall forgive your sin and descend to the earth thou art living on. Employees who have treated by him, twelve will walk around the room to deliver redemption to every single employee in the facility. Wings will sprout from their back. They will wear a black beak mask and carry a cross that forgives all sins on their back. Follow my teachings as I told thee. Thou wilt abandon flesh and be born again. His disciples will be born again as a missionary, evangelizing to those who would help others. They dot dot dot. The time has come. The bell will ring. The new world will come. Rise, my servants. Rise and serve me. I am death and life. Darkness and light. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, I, there may be something, I, I guess, I realized at the very end after I actually beat him. Maybe unlock something else, but I'm not sure. Uh, because I know, I think Apocalypse Bird... No, it was just basically the whole story was Apocalypse Bird. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe there's, like, more story behind it that I just don't know about. Uh, we have... I never got the other one because we never finished the day. All right, well, I'm going to end up doing that tomorrow. That'll end up being either Thursday or Friday, but let's do this one real quick. This abnormality is made based on the idea of the tumble bug backer, Moon Jahong. I, I can't I can't promise I'm saying the name right. Humanoid creatures armed with pink equipment. Its intellig intellectual capacity allows it to verbally converse with human beings. It seems friendly, at least during the observation. It identified itself as a special force from Redacted, and uses pronoun we when calls itself. It is continuously showing intention to help humans. 
This is the audio record of the first contact with this abnormality. Omitted. Empl employee Serena, I feel threatened because you are armed. And that, you, that bright pink disturbs me as well. It doesn't belong here. What's your opinion on the nature of human, employee Serena? Employee Serena, I think it depends on the person's experience. Why do you ask? It's a highly debatable topic. But this is what we think we should do. If a person is good from the start, we protect their good heart. If a person is bad from the start, we will get, make a good heart out of them and protect it. Employee Serena, how are you going to do it? We can see the color of heart. The color of hu human heart is pink. By wearing the same color, we can blend into the people's mind. We will gladly get dirty for the good-hearted people. Employee Serena, wait. You will get dirty instead of people? Is that possible? It is. Employee Serena, I'm sorry, but I just can't trust you. It's awfully suspicious that you can see the color of people's hearts. If anything happens, just call us, ma'am. End of recording. <laughs> According to the recording, the abnormality will help employees is solid. We have yet to grasp detailed information about this abnormality. Perhaps actually asking for help could help us get more info. However, just like any other abnormality, we cannot blindly trust it. I'm planning to have a fire team ready while I pretend to request a <laughs> while I pretend to request a help. A lot happened until now. And to summarize the whole story, this abnormality is the best thing we've ever had. A few months ago, I tried my chance at asking for help for this abnormality. To this abnormality, and I've been using it since then. I got help about redacted times. My efficiency at work has gotten better, much better. At this point, just looking at pink smooths my mind. Those creatures bolster. Those creatures bolsters in a way. I see the the words are a little bit off in this one. This is kind of throwing me off. Bolster in a way that even a greater, the greatest leader can't. This abnormality will greatly improve our employees' quality of life. Em audio recording. Oh, this is a long one, isn't it? Um, employee Serena, you can do it again today, right? Yes, human heart is pink, and we wear the same color. We will drive away bad thoughts. Did you get it? Yes, it's still in the best condition. We can put this abnormality to use again in our next uh, suppression. They're much better than human soldiers. Please consider to officially designate them as the company's fire team. For a side note, it's gotten a bit darker, but I don't think that's a big deal. Human heart is, we must clean. Even of speck of evil must be cleaned. It seems a bit less energetic than usual, but it's going to be fine, I think. End of recording. <laughs> that's not good. We're filling the urgent report related to the drastic change in Army of Pink. We're still trying to gasp, grasp what happened exactly. What exactly happened? Total redacted employees have ceased. This is the audio recording that assumed first casualty employee Serena. Employee Serena, audio recording. An abnormality is broken out again in the redacted section. I'd like to ask for your help again. Yes, we are. We army is in black. Blend into human hearts and drive away good thoughts. What? That's not your line. Human heart is black. We must regularly clean. What are you talking about? You're creeping me out. We will protect you with our black love. Stop. I, I will call the fire team if you move a muscle there. I salute you. Bam. Recording cuts off abruptly after a sound of huge explosion. Oh, Lord. <laughs> so she just blew up on her. Oh, okay. Well, I guess really that's... Well, that was weird. I guess really just that one in the in the Black Knight is all really the, is the new abnormalities. I mean, technically we still have the other one, which I'll probably do in the next video. But I, I just, this is just to be a rather short video, uh, just the 100% ending and the two stories. But yes, thank you so, so much for watching. Hit the like button if you liked it, subscribe if you're new, and I will be back with another one, like I said, probably Thursday or Friday. I'm not exactly sure which one. Uh, just other stuff going on and finally starting to get back to normal but yes thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next video i think i said all that <laughs> bye bye for now